The Cottenham Hunters chase is next down. This is a three and a quarter mile. Nought to 100. The top one is White Rum for Martin Leedham. Tullamore Sloan for Daniel French. Neo Branova, Martin Leedham. Steeple Jack Ladd. Graham Clutterbuck, Summer Suspicion, Dan Hughes, Trooper, Craig Beckwith, Ra Deer, David Hooley, Interact Turquoise, Vinnie Gerard, Constant Cupid, Dan Hughes, Segra Tetzaletzi, for James Shea, Annie Walker, Thomas Rogers, Dan City, Fami, Alex Cherry, Christopher's Burner, Ryan Costello, Whenever Dragoon, Alex Cherry, Herbalistic Rumpus, Ryan Costello, and Lexington Blade, Vinnie Gerard. This one should be a good one, pretty competitive, you thought, with 16 runners. And. Standing patiently, ready to start, and no invisible fences this time, and away they go. And it's a short run to the first, which is a ditch, and all safely to the other side of it with whenever. Oh no, they're not. Summer Suspicion's gone, so Summer Suspicion is a faller at the first, and down to the second, and they're all safely over it this time with Neo run over and whenever Dragoon, both like to front run, and they've gone off pretty quickly. Rod there also likes to be up there in the van, so. There's going to be no shortage of pace in this one as they take the third, and that may be what caught out some of suspicion earlier on. Also, White Rum is towards the back at the moment as well. I might be going a bit quick for him. But it's Neo run over, and we'll never dragoon. A couple of lengths clear of Ra Deer in third, who in turn is three lengths clear of Constant Cupid. And Dan Silly family, but they're already getting quite strong out. But on this tight track, you'd probably expect to see them strung out like washing later on. They're all safely over the fourth, making their way towards the fifth with Neo run over and whenever Dragoon disputing the lead. Rad there, closest to us in third, is probably not that far off them. As they take the next one, Rad here made a mistake. He's not going to do its chance of joining the leading pair any good. Over and over and one over Dragoon. Oh, two lengths clear of Rod there, and then Constant Cupid back in fourth. Then Herbalistic Rumpus and the over and over went right the way through that. Quite a lot of these are prone to jumping errors. If you remember that Cheltenham, the over and over crashed out at the final fence when in the lead. Whenever Dragoon has now got the lead, the over and over and Rod there, second and third. Then a gap back to Constant Cupid and Herbalistic Rumpus. Gap then back to the Main bunch of the runners who are just about headed by Dan City Fami on the inside of Segretet's Alexi. Annie Walker is close up, so it's Tullamore Sloan, then Trooper White Rum creeping close from the rail as well. Look into the back, Christopher Burn is just a back marker and Rod there, another mistake at that one as Neo run over goes back into the lead again. So Neo run over back in front. From whenever Dragoon second, Rod there, and Herbalistic Rumpus are running quite wide on the track. Then Constant Cupid and Annie Walker and Tullamore Sloan and then Segretetsa Lexi and Silly Fami and Troopers they take that ditch they're all safely over the ditch with White Rum and Christopher's Burner two greys at the back over the ninth and this time it was Steeple Jack Ladd that made the mistake towards the back all grown Clutterbuck but Neo run over in front still out of this plain one of a slow jump there by Trooper, but Neo Branova's in front, Rad there is probably just second, whenever Dragoon third, gap of three then to Annie Walker who's now fourth, well that one's inside is Constant Cupid, and the Herbalistic Rumpus still running a bit wide but now tucking in a little bit, Tullamore Sloan's behind them, then Dan Silly Family and Trooper, then a gap to Interact Turquoise and Segretetsa Lexi, then White Rum on the rail behind that one, Lexington Blade and Steeple Jack Ladd, and then the back marker is Christopher's Burner as they get over number 11. And they've only got a mile and a half to go now. With Neo run over and Ra there, disputing the lead. Whenever Dragoon tucked in behind in third. Over the next, they get a mistake there by Herbalistic Rumpus, and also towards the back by Lexington Blade, but Ra there. Might be just in the lead now then. As they come through to take the fence, that'll be the last on the next circuit, I believe. As they get over it. Neo run over and Radia disputing the lead. From whenever Dragoon in second. And Tullamore, oh, sorry, third, whatever. Uh, Tullamore Sloan is back in fourth. Then comes Herbalistic Rumpus and Comp Constant Cupid. With Annie Walker after that one. 
as they race away then now. We're now towards the final mile of the race with Radia on the outside of Neo Renova. Gap of two to win over Dragoon, still going well in third. Then Tullamore Slowly is back in fourth as they take the next. And over that one they go. What is a fall of their constant Cupid's gone? So the stable companion to the horse that fell earlier on, they're the only two that are out so far. But it's Radia from Neo Renova who's been pushed along. Gap of three lengths back to Whenever Dragoon and Tullamore Sloan. Then Dan Silly family as they get over the next. And Neo Renova's gone off into the lead again. By a length to Radia in second. Gap back then to the Alex Cherry pair. Whenever Dragoon and Dan Silly family over the 16th they go. And they're all safely over that one. With Neo Renova now kicking on again. And racing off for home. She's got quite a big weight there as they get to the 17th. Over that one nicely. Suddenly gone five or six clear of Radia in second. Troopers now running on into second. Then comes Annie Walker dancing the family. And then whenever Dragoon and Tullamore slow. They've only got four more fences to take there. And Neo Renova is in the lead. From Trooper and Radia. They've only got three more fences to take actually. And it's Neo Renova in front. But they're getting closer now. And Trooper is in second. Annie Walker moves through into third. Rardy is still there. Then Tullamore Sloan. As they come down this third last. Neo Renova gets to the lead. Trooper makes a mistake. Annie Walker got over it one in second. Neo Renova now being collared by Annie Walker off a featherweight. And fit the featherweighted let Annie Walker takes it up. Tullamore Sloan then comes into second. Neo Renova's beaten. Rardy is trying to run on again. Then comes whenever Dragoon still trying to get back into it. Over the second last they go. And it's Annie Walker from Tullamore Sloan. Then comes Rardy or whatever Dragoon. But it's Annie Walker racing into the straight then with just one to jump and Annie Walker looks like she's probably only going to jump the last to win but Tullamore Sloan is now fighting back then comes whenever Dragoon over the final fence they go better jump by Tullamore Sloan and Tullamore Sloan takes it up and races up towards the line and Tullamore Sloan is going to take it from whenever Dragoon in second Annie Walker third fast finishing steeplejack ladders fourth then Radir and Interact Circles and all the way back to Herbalistic Rumpers and one or two of them never got into that race at all today and it's another one for Daniel French with Tullamore Sloan like Annie Walker had got that one at one point and Tullamore Sloan takes it for Daniel French and whenever Dragoon for Alex Cherry second Annie Walker for Thomas Rogers third Steeplejack Lad was fourth for Graham Clutterbuck and Interact Turquoise for Vinnie Gerrard was fifth